Hello, 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 hello. Um, I'm coming to you live from my kitchen. Safe space, judge-free space, but Dane did the dishes. Um, so I am grateful. Okay, ladies, tonight we played the Wildcats, the team in red. They didn't have all their players. They didn't have their best players, but they have a quarterback who loves to run. Yes, she does. Yes, she does. <coughs> Excuse me. And we need to work smarter and not harder because we can beat them. I believe in each and every one of us. I do. I do. I do. I do. So we lost 18-0. I wish it was vodka. Not tonight, but it could be. But that's okay. What was important about tonight is it was our third game as a team. We had 13 players. Ashley O'Connor, you said you were coming. You weren't there. I hope you're okay. I don't have a message from you, so I'm a little bit worried. So if you can just send a carrier pigeon, a text, show up at my door uh, and let me know you're okay, that would be great. Okay. So in no particular order, I'm going to do a rundown of some game time highlights. Stephanie Clark, interception. Hello, hello, hello. God, I love when that happens on defense. And that is just to show you what we said in practice, what we say in the games. When you're on defense, yes, you're defending, but that ball that's being thrown is just as much your ball as it is their ball. So if you can grab it, if you see it coming, don't wait for them to catch it, intercept it. If you can't intercept it, smack it down. And then there's that theory, and you know I've said it, and I learned it from the best. If you can put your hand on it, you can grab it. And then if you can't do any of that, tag them. So on defense, again, that ball, that ball is your ball. You call that ball. You fight for that ball. So great job with the interception. Uh, Nicole, excellent, excellent willingness to learn. I was really excited to see how you would be on defense and offense, just based on what we saw in practice and how you were the past two games. I'm glad your groin is feeling better. Keep stretching, keep resting, keep icing that, keep putting on some heat rub. Uh, really great job in following through with positioning. And when you're told a specific route, you did it. And it's hard. It's hard to run your route, especially when all of a sudden, you know, you're not running it invisibly. There's defense and you have to go around them. But the route running is so critical because what you do affects the next person, affects the next person, especially if people are coming in and people are going out. All of those different levels are intertwining and making gaps for the quarterback to see spaces that people are available. And it also moves that defense. It draws them out or draws them in or does whatever it's supposed to do. Essay. Excellent route running. So this is just building upon what I just said about Nicole, but you are one of those players who has that knowledge and that experience that you understand that route you're running is so critical. Even if the ball, even if the play is not meant for you, number one, even if the play is not meant for you, you can always get the ball. So be be prepared to get the ball. Even if you're like, oh, it's the queen's curl and I'm not doing the curl, you could still get the ball. But what's really important is the way that you play your positioning and you just keep consistently running at that same pace, which is great for the quarterback because then they can learn your speed and they know where to hit you. Uh, Shannon, amazing balls. You had some fabulous reads on offense tonight. Grateful for your partnership on defense and especially helping the new people learn the positioning. But really, I hope your shoulder's okay. Hope your groin's okay stretching your foot. Um, but really good balls, really good reads. And you were Michelle. This is, this is the next person on my list. I'm just going down the lineup. Michelle. I'm going to call you monkey girl, Michelle. Well, that doesn't really sound nice, but it comes from a place of love. You were all over the place. There, at one point, Shannon threw the ball to Steph. It bounced out of her hands. You swooped down and you got it. Oh, my goodness. I was so excited. I almost peed my pants. That was amazing. You never give up. Whether you're on offense, whether you're on defense, you come out with 110%. And it is so refreshing. It's so positive, And it's it's welcome. It's, it's, it's amazing. Thank you. Also, love the jerseys. Much love to Capri. Uh, Rita, really good job on offense. Tonight we just tried you in one position and I think you were really feeling comfortable by the end and really asking questions. And we are all grateful. Returners, new people, anybody, ask questions. We're here to learn and win and have fun as a team. And if you don't know, or if you're nervous, or if you don't think you know, or even if you do know, sometimes it is still good to ask questions. And that's one of the things that I really am grateful for, Rita, is that you always come with a smile on your face, a willingness to learn, and you ask questions because we're all here to help. We all want to do well together. Awesome. Uh, and your attitude is just so infectious and so positive. It's fabulous. Marissa, 
Girl, I love that height. I love that height. I loved how we ended the game on a high note. You caught that ball. Amazing. Uh, we know we can count on you to really have that knowledge of play and keep helping us move the ball up the field and on defense with positioning. You're really good at staying in your zone. And so we are so grateful for that. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Ashlyn, we had you on corner. I know that was new. I know we talked about it last game. I really like you on corner. I think you were really starting to get a grasp of it. And it does take time. Um, but really knowing that corners are soft and the critical role that they play in kind of pushing the players in, just really good job. Really, really good job, Ashlyn. You should be proud of yourself. Uh, Mia, great job rushing. I know we had you a little bit on offense and you were doing really well heightening the field and also running those routes, but really good job on rush. You shared it with Jen. Jen, great job on rush. Um, you know, it was, it was really nice seeing you. I hope you're not injured. I hope you're okay. Rest. Um, one friendly reminder, this is for anybody, but I'm only bringing it up to Jennifer because I saw your name here. Uh, you gotta go to the bathroom. You gotta make a phone call. You know, the kids need you. No worries. Life happens. Just let us know. I know we switched series and we were looking for you. And then I was worried something happened that you disappeared because that's the mama bear in me. If I don't know where you are and then you're gone, oh my goodness, I get worried. So I'm glad you're okay. I'm glad you're just in the bathroom. You do you. Uh, just, you know, tell somebody because then we don't we don't worry. That goes for anybody. We don't want to worry. Uh, Rula, I know today was shitty. And I know it's hard for you. And it's going to be hard forever. Um, but you came and it was good to see you and hopefully it was good for you to be around friends and family and people that love and support you. So I am thinking of you today, tomorrow, and always. Ashley C. Mama, booby, ball, repeat. Yes. Uh, tonight we had you on corner. You were asking a lot of really good questions and you never gave up. And that's what we want. You know, we're not going to hit the ball running off the get go. We're, there's going to be a learning curve. We're going to learn. We're going to grow. We're going to adapt. Keep asking those questions and do what you got to do. We're so grateful that your mom was there uh, to help with Charlie and that you were just able to come out and play and try your best and have fun. Anyways, I think that's it, everybody. I know we lost. I'm at my seven minute limit and seven's my lucky number. So good night. I love you all. Uh, keep at it and ask questions and let's have fun. I'm excited for next week. Please RSVP in advance. So please do it by Sunday night so that I'm not scrambling with the lineup. Um, and I really try to put people in positions where I know they're going to excel, where they're going to work in a good partnership, where I, I can see their strength and their ability. I do think I have a knack for that, uh, not to toot my own horn. I really try uh, to put people based on their area of skill, but maybe I don't see everything because I am not perfect and I am clearly blind most days. Um, so reach out and let me know if there's something you want to try or something that you see that I might not see. I'm always open uh, to figure out a way that makes everybody happy, healthy, and terrific. Okay, take care.